Welcome to the BMW Motorcycle Club of Queensland's How To Series. In this procedure we're going to cover recovering your password. Before you begin, if you do not have a valid email address or you prefer not to give one, then you need to contact web admin on the telephone number on the website under support. The member login area is located in the left hand panel of the home page and click on got your login. The first step is to click on lost password. Here you'll need to know your username. Typically your username is your first name, last name, without any spaces or punctuation. When you enter your username and press tab, a system check will verify that the username does exist on the site. The next stage is to enter your email address and click on send password. If you successfully send your password, you'll receive a message to tell you so. If the email address that you enter is not linked to the user, then you'll receive an error message saying, sorry, no corresponding user was found. Here you're going to have to con contact the BMW MCQ web admin under the support menu. It's always a good idea when you do so that you actually supply your full name, address, membership expiry date and membership number. To assist you in this regard, a list of usernames with unknown email addresses is available under the help menu. If you enter a username and press tab and it comes up with a system message to say it does not exist, then you're going to have to initiate a two-stage process to recover your password. The first stage is to recover your username. So we click off lost password and click on lost username and enter the email address. If the email address is correct, you will again receive the success message. If the email address is not correct, you'll receive an error message to tell you that it does not exist on the site. At this point, you'll actually have to contact the web admin people again and supply the details required to actually get you onto the system. Assuming that everything's gone well and you've now got your username and password, come back to the site, enter your username, and your password and click login. When the member menu comes up you'll know that you are successful. It's a good idea at this point to click on my details, go to the edit button and update my profile, click on contact information and enter your password and verify your password. This will ensure that your password remains secure and you're the only person that will know it. You can also go to the member menu and update all the records there as well. If you receive a message during the login that warns you that your membership has expired and you believe this to be incorrect, then please contact the records section by sending an email via the committee menu at the top of the web page. When you contact records, it will also save time to supply your full name, address, membership expiry date and membership number. If the above message is correct and your account has indeed expired and you want to renew via the web, then all you've got to do is simply click on reactivate. If you do not want to use the web to renew your membership, then you have to go to the downloads menu and select the club membership form. Print the form and complete it and send it in to the address on the form with your payment. That concludes how to recover your password. I hope you enjoy your website.